Hi everybody. <coughs> so in this video we are finishing up the cleaning and prepping of pieces and will begin riveting the inner web of spars, I don't know, spars and ribs and stringers and oh my. Here we go, finally. So, rivet squeezer is out. Uh, we start off with the two inner stringers and the webbing and uh, the two bent inner ribs. The ones whose flanges are pre-bent to deliver a nice uh, 10 to uh, 12 and a half degree slant. I think the angle is 12 and a half degree. Uh, don't quote me on that one. So part of putting this together is, yes, so the two ribs are uh, at an angle. Uh, thus meaning that the easy space to work in between the flanges where the rivets of the ribs to the webbing does not make it very simple. The big 90 degree bucking bar that I have just won't fit into, you know, 70 degrees of space. So there you can see I've got the long one foot offset uh, rivet set that I'm using. Works like a charm. And I do love working on interior pieces. Just nice big fat dome head rivets, don't have to worry about dimpling, don't have to worry about uh, countersinking. Just make sure the holes are clean, put a rivet in, buck it up, and it's done. That's right, put your mask back on, idiot. So, yep, yeah, uh, now that the mid a uh, small piece in the center is constructed, we will be moving on to starting to put all of this onto the front spar, which we will do next time. See ya. 